our life is very ordinary. And though it may be different than the way you live or the way that others live, for us, this is just life. Daily life that's the same day in and day out. We get up when the sun comes up, we pour our hot coffee, and we face the day. The days for us aren't extraordinary. We've got four children and a small farm to care for. Our days are ripe with the most ordinary and basic tasks surrounding these responsibilities. Things like making breakfast, brushing teeth, cleaning bedrooms. Here we are. There are very few mountaintop moments in life. Stu and I have gotten married, had our babies, and now we're here. Day in and day out, facing this normal life. And over time, in this space, we have come to peace with not seeking grand adventures. Something as simple as melting butter on a skillet and giving thanks for day-old bread that saved you for breakfast. Maybe these are the days. Maybe this ordinary life is the adventure. Have you ever thought about that? The fact that your passport may never be filled, your savings account may never be bursting, maybe you'll never get the promotion you planned for or actually strike out on that grand adventure. Maybe your life will just be ordinary. Is that a bad thing? Some could argue that maybe that means your potential as a human is never fully reached. And maybe, just maybe, they're totally wrong. Maybe our very best potential as humans isn't seeking those summits of grand adventure, those mountaintop experiences. Maybe it's just fully and completely deeply rooted in recognizing that this ordinary life, something like making breakfast for your family or enjoying a perfectly ripe tomato, I don't, maybe that's the entire purpose of it all. Giving thanks for what's right in front of you. 
not seeking something grander or greater, a better status update. What's here? What's here right now for the taking? When things are around us every day, it's easy to not only take them for granted, but fail to see the magic in them. Oh, if we only had eyes to see the magic before us, to sense it all, to smell it all, to feel it all. Fully and completely, could we be willing to experience these tasks, the words that are said, the food that's eaten, the challenges that are presented with the zeal that we approach those mountaintop moments? What if the daily grind is the mountaintop? world that rushes by it's so eager to move on something bigger and better i am hungry for this the value in what the world says has none the deep details of ordinary life it's no small thing to faithfully live out your ordinary days with love and great and deep purpose. It's no small thing to see the deep blessings of value that are woven right before our eyes, right here today, right in front of us. Most of our lives aren't extraordinary. We'll go to the same job, do the same thing, faithfully be with our spouse or raise our children, have our friends, our family, our community. And some would argue that life isn't worth living unless you're chasing grand, elaborate rainbows. Maybe our ordinary lives already are the rainbows that we're chasing, and we just need eyes that are willing to see them. Maybe ordinary is perfect.